Hello, Erica. Thank you so much for your speech on Barks. It was great that you started off your speech with such a personal example that you really illustrated why you were talking about Barks and that you actually volunteered for them. That really improved your credibility. Some, something else that improved your credibility was the primary source of holding an interview with someone who works for the organization. Um, it really helped to center that and really gave you like a two-handed punch um, credibility-wise as well and um, it just made me feel like you knew what you're talking about. I loved the resources that you gave and that you cited them, which is most important, I think, credibility-wise and just so I trust you. Uh, I love the ASPCA. I go there for a lot of my information. I personally just fostered or um, adopted a dog two months ago and I just can't imagine my life without her. So this is also a cause that's near and dear to my heart because I just, I've just seen her grow in leaps and bounds. She was hurt, um, abused beforehand and now she's just thriving and I can't wait to see how much more she's going to thrive afterwards. I also like that you emphasize that fostering a dog saves two lives. I would have added that um, adopting saves two lives as well because it frees up that space. I love that you summarized in your conclusion just the wonderful ways that you can support this organization. The one thing I wish is that you didn't use you know and um during your speech just because it did make you seem a little bit nervous. You otherwise, you did a wonderful job and I, if I lived in the area, I would definitely support that cause and think that it's a worthy cause for you to champion. Thank you.